so mad I could scream. For years I've been cutting out pictures and articles on Ethan Crane. And, w and when I finally get a chance to see him in person, maybe even meet him, what am I doing? Arguing with some nutcase who got paint all over my best sweater. Teresa, you and your dreams about meeting Ethan Crane. I will meet him. And what about you, Whitney? Don't you have that dream of being the best tennis player in the world? Yes, but hopefully mine will come true because I work hard. But this? I mean, look at this room. What's wrong with it? It's like a shrine to fashion and unrealistic dreams. Maybe your brother Louise is right. Maybe you are living too much in a fantasy world. I don't believe it. Has Louise brainwashed you? Next thing you'll be telling me I should take that job at the Burr Hut. You do need money for college. I'll find a way to make money myself and help Mama out too. Well, you better do it fast. Or else Louise will make you take a job at the cannery scaling fish. He wouldn't. If I say it's a foul, then it's a foul. He would. You think pit bulls can take human form? Because that's what Luis is, a pit bull. He won't let go till I take that awful job at the burger hut. It might not be so bad. Then you work there. I've already got a summer job. I'm teaching kids tennis at the country club. The country club? I'm so jealous. Why? It's just a job. Just a job? Slinging burgers is just a job, but the country club? I dream of going there. Everyone dressed in fabulous clothes, having fabulous parties. <sighs> These dreams you have. What? You think I'm not good enough to go to parties at the country club? Of course not. But what's the point of fantasizing about it? I mean, we don't belong to the country club. We don't even know people that belong to the country club. I could have met them if I'd gotten that job at Lowell's. Lowell's? I applied for a job in their evening dress shop. And I would have gotten it if my hair was blonde or if I was a deb. Teresa, Lowell's is the most exclusive shop in town. They only hire people with experience. <laughs> I know more about fashion than any saleswoman in that store. They didn't hire me because I'm not one of them. They think I'm not good enough to be anything more than a maid like Mama. Well, they're wrong. I'm going to have a big house one day, as big as the cranes. And I'm going to let Mama give the orders, not take them. Mama. Hi, Mrs. Lopez Fitzgerald. Hi, Whitney. Mama, you look tired. Why don't you go lie down? Your brothers will be wanting dinner. Oh, I forgot. It was my turn to make dinner. I'm sorry. That's okay. I'll get it. I brought you some magazines that Mrs. Uh, Crane was going to throw away. And there's also a nail polish she didn't like. Provocative pink? This is the color this year. Oh, I love it. You look troubled, Mrs. Lopez Fitzgerald. Is everything okay? Sheridan Crane was in a car accident in Paris. Ethan's aunt? Is she all right? I don't know. I pray she will be. Oh, she's had such a painful life. Perfect. Hey, tell me that magazine, Whitney. Sure. Not L, City and Country. Oh, you and your society magazines. Careful, my man. Me? I like them. It keeps me up on all those people I'm going to meet after I marry Ethan Crane. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Julian and Ivy Crane with son Ethan at Harmony Hospital Gala. Ivy, that dress isn't right for you. The green dress you wore last month was much more flattering. Oh, well, you can tell her that next time you're at the country club. I shall. Uh -huh. <laughs> so pleased to meet you, Mr. and Mrs. Crane. I'm Teresa Lopez Fitzgerald. That's right, of THE Lopez Fitzgerald. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, who are you? Oh, your Ivy son. Oh, well, I'd love to dance with you, Ethan. <laughs> you are nuts. <laughs> dance every dance with you? I think that could be arranged, Ethan. Oh! <laughs> Have you ever heard of knocking? Oh, have you ever heard of responsibility? Well, you're up here playing out some ridiculous fantasy about socializing with the cranes. Mom is making the dinner that you were supposed to cook. Well, speaking of dinner, I better get home. Don't go. I think I better. Night, Louise. Whitney, Mom is